Welcome back to Fox 17 Morning Mix. All right, we hear more and more people eating a plant-based diet. Okay, so what is a plant-based diet exactly, and how can Spectrum Health guide you through clean eating, especially in the morning? Joining me in the studio this morning is Elizabeth Suvetti, Manager of Culinary Medicine at Spectrum. Thanks so much for being here with us today. Thank you. Good morning. Yes, we're so excited to talk about plant-based diets and what that entails with everybody. So. And so many people might picture a little rabbit out nibbling on some cabbage or something like that. It's not like that. I mean, there's some things probably incorporated. Yes. But let's let's talk about what is a plant-based diet. So first off, it can be absolutely delicious, and that's what we want to show people today. Um, and really, it's around incorporating more whole plant-based foods in your diet. Those can be fruits, vegetables, whole grains, legumes, nuts, seeds. All of those things can be incorporated in that whole plant food-based um, diet, and they're really packed with great nutrients. And so that's what we want to make sure people are getting when they're eating is that great nutrients. And why is that so important for us? So within culinary medicine, which falls within like lifestyle medicine at Spectrum Health, um, we know there's a very strong correlation between what people are eating and their overall health. And so through diet, you can really prevent and in some cases reverse different diseases. And so we want to make sure people really understand that connection. And so we try to teach them that through the various cooking classes that we have for people and in, in, um, all throughout Grand Rapids. And really now that we're virtual, we can we have classes that reach people all throughout the world. I so we want to make sure they understand that connection. As much as you guys want to stay in business, you also want to keep people out of your hospitals and everything. So by offering these classes and stuff like that, the educational part of it is so important. So yes. you guys have a special challenge coming up. Yes, yeah, we do. We have our Plant Powered Challenge. It kicks off in January. Registration opens today. You guys are the first people we're sharing this with. Oh, great. Um, people can register through spectrumhealth.org slash plant power. Um, and it's a 30 day challenge in which people, we're going to kind of give them the tools that they need and the education to hopefully want to make those lasting lifelong changes within their health and what they're eating. Okay, great. So let's go ahead and walk uh, everybody yeah. through an example. Obviously, it's breakfast time right now. Uh, quick and easy is always great, uh, but of course, nutritious and yummy is yeah, good too. Yeah, so we've got some great examples today, and one of my favorites is our baked oatmeal. Um, this is, has chocolate chips in it, so it's especially kind of fun for people who enjoy a little bit of chocolate. You can have chocolate. Okay. Yeah, so I'm just going to show you real quick. Basically, we've got some dry ingredients here. We've We've got um, some oats here that we're going to throw into a bowl. Um, we've got some baking soda, a little bit of cinnamon, a little bit of salt, and then we're going to add those chocolate chips mm. in. And we'll just give that a nice little mix. And a lot of times when I make this, I like to make a double batch. Oh, yeah. And that way I can freeze them and then pull them out for my kids and they can quickly grab them on the go. Um, then we'll mix the liquids in a bowl. <clears throat> And we've got some soy milk with a little bit of vanilla. We've got a ripe banana that we mashed up that we're going to throw in kind of that natural sweetener. I always have those bananas. I never know what to do with them. I, don't, I hate wasting yeah, them. Yeah, you can throw them in the freezer, then use them for cooking later. We put a little maple syrup in. Flaxseed, this is a great source of fiber mm -hmm. and protein. And then we'll put a little peanut butter in. For anybody who doesn't do peanut butter, you could do almond butter or a sun butter. All of those work great. And then essentially you just kind of mix this up and combine it. And finally, you know, the wet and the dry go together. Um, and I'll give this a stir, and then basically what we would do is we'd put this in a muffin tin, we would put it in the oven, let it bake at 350, and we'll share this recipe so everybody yeah, has it. Yeah, absolutely, sure. Um, and it's so good, you actually probably just want to taste it as it is. But yeah, we'll throw this in a muffin tin, we'll bake it, um, and then when it's all done, we have Look our little finished product here. So. These are our chocolate chip baked oatmeal cups. And like I said, I usually will grab one of those out the door, maybe some fresh fruit with it. Um, and then here's some other great examples of plant-based breakfast. This one right here is tofu speaking to me. Tofu scramble. A lot of people don't say they don't like tofu, and then we show them how to make it this way, and they feel like they're eating scrambled eggs. We got yeah. a little avocado there. This is just a great hearty oatmeal. I know it's really important to make sure you feel full in the morning, and oatmeal is a great way to do that with a little bit of fruit and some nuts and seeds. I love this, you guys. They're throwing it all out there for you guys to take part in this challenge. If people want to take part in the challenge, where can they sign up or learn more? Yeah, so they can sign up through our website directly. That's spectrumhealth.org slash plant power. Okay. Um, and we have all the sign up is there, all the information. There are so many webinars and cooking classes. Um, we've got people from the community coming in, different doctors that are going to be doing cooking demonstrations. Mm -hmm. Like There is so much great free content that we're really hoping Last year we had about 3,000 people sign up and we're hoping to have an even bigger, better experience this year for everybody. Well, so. thank you so much for these great recipes this morning. Yeah, thank, thank you for having me on. It's great to have you here in the studio. Again, we'll get all this information on our website, fox17morningmix.com, coming up a little later today. Again, spectrumhealth.org slash plantpower, 616-486-0385 to learn more.